Okay, this is the third and probably final segment in this video. I went ahead and changed out this negative plate. As you can see, there are a few grooves in the plate. Um, this is again the same positive plate, same neutral plate, uh, but just a different, uh, different negative plate. Again, this plate was uh, sanded, if you will, and uh, I put some uh, some grooves uh, horizontally along this plate, just to see if uh, if there's any more production, at least visible production from those grooves, at least the edges of the grooves along the grooves. Um, if there is, uh, there's a lot more questions now that I have than uh, than answers. Um, a lot more questions. Go ahead and turn on the power here for just a second. We'll see what happens. Okay, well, looks about the same as the previous plate. It's on. Now it's off. I'm going to go ahead and turn this on. Just look at it for a couple of seconds. It doesn't appear to be produced. Oh, wait a minute now. Let me zoom the camera around here. I want to show you something. There seems to be right there, right there, and right there. Right there and right there. As you can see, there seems to be like a like a, a small rift where the gas seems to be accumulating and just, just creating a nice flow, a nice interruption in the current there. It just so happens those are two gouges in the plate that I created. Now, is the gas being released around the edges of those grooves detaching from the plates quicker than, say, where there is not a groove? I'm not sure. I think the ultimate test, of course, would be to take all three concepts and measure the output. I think then and only then you can make some, start making some fair judgments, fair assessments of the situation. And if there are some videos out there or some more information that some others have done that you guys have, have uh, constructed, please, please show me, direct me. Um, but right now, visually, it looks like there's more production from the coarse plates. Again, I cannot confirm that. And as we all know, visually, uh, our eyes can be deceived. 